Now go ahead and please be seated, and we have the choir that's going to come and uh, have a couple of songs as we uh, think of the death, burial, resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, and uh, of course, the first one, a very convicting uh, song for me. And I appreciate the choir and all the work that they've put into this. And then we have Brother James is going to read the scriptures for us also that goes with the, the songs. The Bible tells us in Matthew chapter 26 that Jesus was meeting with his apostles. And in verse 31, he begins, Then saith Jesus unto them, All ye shall be offended because of me this night. For it is written, I will smite the shepherd, and the sheep of the flock shall be scattered abroad. But after I am risen again, I will go before you into Galilee. Peter answered and said unto him, Though all men shall be offended because of thee, yet will I never be offended. Jesus said unto him, Verily I say unto thee, that this night before the cock crow, thou shalt deny me thrice. Peter said unto him, Though I should die with thee, yet will I not deny thee. Likewise also said all the disciples. Then cometh Jesus with them unto a place called Gethsemane, and saith unto the disciples, Sit ye here while I go and pray yonder. Then Jesus was betrayed, put on trial, crucified unto death. But three days later, he arose from the grave. He appeared unto his disciples. And in John chapter 20, verse 24, it says, But Thomas, one of the twelve, called Didymus, was not with them when Jesus came. The other disciples therefore said unto him, we have seen the Lord. But he said unto them, Except I shall see in his hands the print of the nails, and put my finger into the print of the nails, 
and thrust my hand into his side, I will not believe. And after eight days again, his disciples were within, and Thomas with them. Then came Jesus, the doors being shut, and stood in the midst and said, Peace be unto you. Then saith he to Thomas, Reach hither thy finger, and behold my hands, and reach hither thy hand, and thrust it into my side, and be not faithless, but believing. And Thomas answered and said unto him, My Lord and my God. <laughs> 